Hello, Sash Gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Nati. So, I will be hopping right into y'all energy. I want you all to take what feeds, leave what does not. If anything does resonate with you guys, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Swap rolls if needed. Also, Sash Gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for the love, likes, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank y'all for everything that y'all do to help the channel grow. I really love and appreciate you all. So, I am going to do one more shuffle here. I'm going to hop right into the energy for Sagittarius, please. Energy for Sag. <clears throat> What's the energy? Okay, what's this? So, we have someone's husband. You could be a husband, okay. Uh, someone, husband wants to call them. Or someone, so this could be someone that you had a long-term commitment with. This could be someone that has put you in a love triangle. They have sneaking out, okay, and put you in a love triangle, whatever the case is. This person wants to reach out to you here. What's the energy for Sagittarius? The spirit energy for Sagittarius. Okay, so this person was sexting someone, um, talking to someone, possibly someone younger. Um, maybe saying that they were in an unhappy marriage or unhappy relationship, okay? Um, so they were sneaking out, putting you in third-party energy. What's the energy? Um, and they could have been saying that they're stuck in the relationship. But I feel like whoever this husband is or whoever this is that you have this long-term commitment with, they feel stuck with the third party now. They feel stuck with the person that they were texting or sexting. Um, they feel like that's not where they want to be at. That could even be the reason why this marriage is in this situation now uh, where they're feeling unhappy or you could even be feeling unhappy because this person has an issue with sneaking out or sexting other people. Okay, it could cause a lot of fights. Maybe this person is abusive. Now, um, they could have gotten in some sort of verbal or physical altercation with this karmic. Okay, and now they're single. Um, and they're going to be calling you. <laughs> so, I always get that this person is going to be calling you after a fight with the karmic because they feel like they made a mistake by stepping out, sneaking out, sexting, or just involving themselves in third-party energy with the seduction here. So, they feel like they made a mistake here. It could have been messages that were sent back and forth. Um, it could have been anything, right, Sad. So, this person has, they feel like they made a mistake by having an affair, sending cash apps, messaging, calling, talking to someone, whatever they were doing behind your back. Okay, so we're going to hop into the other energy here. One moment. Let me get the cards, y'all. They fail. Okay, you guys. So, yeah, this person that's about to be a big blowout i'm always getting that for y'all person who is this person Sage? okay um so let me do another show for i feel like you're loving on you you're happy um you're at peace i feel as though happiness is here or it's on its way you're going to be extremely pleased with life uh this could be some sort of earth sign taurus virgo or capricorn here okay what's the energy for Sagittarius, please, spirit. So, this person is going to want you to pick them again. It's like they're so, this, whoever this husband is, they are so nervous to call because they know they ass done fucked up. They know they ass done been out for too long. So, they are going to be kind of nervous to call, but they will be calling you, calling back home after this big blowout. They could have even been putting the karmic in the love triangle or sneaking out while they've been with the karmic, okay? So, just take it how it fits. What's the energy for Sagittarius, please, spirit? What's the energy? Okay, so we got fire sign here. So, this could be you, right? Um... This could be another fire sign, another Sag Leo or Aries, right? What is the energy? I feel like this person is going to be reaching out to you, Divine Feminine. They're going to be reaching out to you because I feel like this person is just so sad. It's like they're crying. They could be crying alone. 
they're going to use you as a person to cry on or a shoulder to cry on here. I feel like you're intuitive and you know that this person will be coming in. That could be some sort of legal issues, legal matters, okay? Um, someone could be getting sued, fighting a court battle, getting a lawyer or contracts going wrong. While you're over here being a star, okay, you're not letting this person disappoint you or cause you any sorrow or tricks, right? Uh, so you're being popular, very successful, having a platform known or recognized here. Someone has a big ego. What's the energy? What is the energy for Sagittarius, please? Okay, so you're cutting this cycle off. So this could be some a narcissist or someone with narcissistic traits. So this person has no regard for what is right or wrong. They display violent or antisocial behavior or mental instability. So you are cutting this cycle off now. They feel like they have gone and caught and got caught up with a psycho. So they feel like this karmic is a psycho. They're comparing this karmic to you. They're seeing this karmic as a psycho. They're seeing you as a star. Um, they could be reflecting on their ways. They could be physically abusive here um, and then sneak out. Okay, so they are reflecting on their behaviors. Um, they are thinking about giving you a call after the betrayal here. Okay, I feel like this person just has been very stubborn and stuck in their ways. I feel like this person likes to blame people for things or blame others for the situation. But like I said, they are looking back on their behaviors. Because they could have involved themselves with a fake friend, with a fake karmic, with someone that was using them for clout, okay? With someone that was two-faced or talks about them behind their back, okay? Um, so this person could feel like that. This person has been talking about them behind their back and they're cutting them out, okay? So, um, I will also be cautious with this um, karmic because she could also want you to be involved in this. She could want to sabotage to where this person just hates you or sees you as like a bad person or something. So I would just watch out for this person. Um, now this could be some sort of karmic masculine here that you are dealing with. This Someone's birthday could be coming up or this could be your birthday. I don't know. Someone... I just feel like you're just being a star. Every day is your birthday, Sag. Okay? <laughs> Maybe you got this fake friend's birthday that's coming up. One moment. I feel like they're somewhere burning through money, where they're burning through cash, can't save, spends money faster than they earn it. This person could be like a fake flexor here, but they haven't been posting on social media. Yeah, because this person is a not low-key individual. This person is extremely high-key. But they could be having money issues right now to where they are not posting on social media as much. They are they have a lot going on here with this karmic uh they see you as having abundance material wealth financial stability and security you could be popular or famous you could be very famous here okay but this person is someone who causes mischief for entertainment and they just went and got with a psycho so they already a psycho and then they cutting off the psycho so they got with a narcissist that was just as bad as them so it could be two narcissistic energies together this person don't like that Okay, because you were just so sweet and innocent and they done got with somebody just as bad as they ass. This person can have like nose rings. Um, so yeah, someone is purposely causing um, mischief for entertainment here. Okay, so yeah. Oh my goodness, guys. Let me try to get some tarot here. Uh, so I see the devil card coming out in reverse. The seven of swords coming out in reverse. A lot of truths here. Uh, what's the energy? Now, somebody could be having delays with their finances, with their status, with their money here, okay? And and that's what's going on right now. They're over there with the karmics having a lot of delays, feeling stuck in a relationship, wanting to come to you. Some of these people are even living in a hotel. This looks like a hotel room. Okay, they're living in a hotel, sleeping in another room here. Okay, they want to come to their queen of pentacles, this boss business owner, someone committed and stable. So this person is wanting to call you. They might even be needing your help with stability or with money here. Okay, so yeah, be expecting a phone call from this person because they've been in this community or over there with this karmic in their family. They've been somewhere with a lot of fake friends, a lot of fake karmics. Um, and this turbulence going on, they're trapped in their head. Somebody could even be going to jail behind the karmic here. 
um, or they just trapped in their head in this community because of their financial situation. They chose to breadcrumb you. Now, spirit has taken it's kind of like they're having this karma. So, whatever that was meant for you, whatever was meant for them, you're now getting that now. Okay, you're getting there that whatever was meant for them or both of you guys together, you're getting that. Um, and they're having to be trapped over here in this community, getting the karma that they deserve. Um, now, let's get more energy. Yeah, so spirit is going to be healing you financially, maybe emotionally, physically, mentally, spiritually. Okay. Uh, like I said, for some of you all, you can be on a public platform. You can be a star. You can be um, doing something healing on a public platform. You can be a spiritualist, a herbalist. Okay. But whatever you're doing, I feel like you are pouring a lot of positive energy into the universe. Um, into your community while this person is sitting here thinking about you low on their money holding on to whatever they can okay um pouring into these people it's like and then it's like as soon as they get their money saved or as soon as they get some stability it goes back out into their community and then it's not like their cup is being filled right so wherever you're at um i feel like you're going to be getting an equal give and take but this person is going to have some setbacks in their finances look with the heart fan then I tell you what was meant what was meant for both of y'all or meant for this person just to do right by you and they didn't. You're finna get this because they ghosted you some sort of way. So this is a lesson that you both are learning. Whether you are on the good end of the lesson or whether you are on the bad end of the lesson, you are learning a lesson. This person is learning a lesson. And they're finna have a lot of setbacks in their finances here. A lot of setbacks here. Okay, as you move forward to get yourself in this karma state, in this karma emotions, okay, um, blocking this person. Maybe you felt like with this person, your finances was blocked. So, you're moving away from this individual. But spirit is blocking their finances, though. I'm not lying. They, their finances are getting blocked for how they treated you. And they're stressed here. They are extremely stressed. This is someone that could have been all about themselves with the Knight of Pentacles, with the Knight of Wands. They went somewhere, um, focused on other people, another family, family members, karmic family, karmic relationships. That was not pouring into them. And now they're trying to balance themselves out. This could be some sort of Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Capricorn, Virgo, um, Sag. Gemini, Aries, Leo, okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but if anything resonates with you, Sag, I am sweating in this car, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel, Swap Rose if needed, honey, and until next time, bye.